What's good everybody, man? Life with D Black back with another video. Everything y'all about to see right now uh, is pretty much what was done yesterday. Um, today is today, but what you're about to see right now is what was done yesterday. Um, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. If you've been on the channel and you just tuning in watching, I appreciate you. Um, channel's growing, man. If you're new, if you're new, subscribe, man, and hey, enjoy the content. But uh, this is going to be a good one, man. Um, it's, it's about to get real from here. Hope y'all enjoy this video. It's never been uh, wrecked. Not that I'm aware of. Okay. Headers. Everything is stuck on the uh, engine and transmission. Do you know? Um. As far as I know. Have y'all like did any modifications? We haven't done anything. Okay. If there's anything on here that's modified, it was done prior to me. Okay. It. Um, How long ago did you stop uh, driving it? Um, I just stopped driving it like two, not even three months ago. But okay. I mean, every now and then I'll take it and drive it around just to charge up the battery and make sure it's still good. Okay. Like it was actually just driven Thursday, mm -hmm. last Thursday. Got you. Okay. Let me just show everything else here. Y'all took care of the, the car pretty good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, like I said, this was a project car for me, so we were working on cleaning it up. Right. Um, those mirrors that are in the back, mm -hmm. those are aftermarket mirrors that were on it when I got it. Okay. Um, they just weren't took them attached. Off. They were just, they were too small. Like, I couldn't see anything out of them, so I put the stock ones back on it. Gotcha. Okay. And the trunk, how does that open up? So With the trunk has a latch mm -hmm. right here. Okay. Then it opens up. Cool. Those back seats fold down if you need the extra room for anything. Okay. It's got aftermarket exhaust on it. Oh, yeah, I seen that pulling up. It's pretty thick. It's not loud, is it? No. Okay, no. good, good. <laughs> That's a plus. You want me to start it up? Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. Hey, my windshield wipers are on. <laughs> uh, oh, it's not gonna start now. I'm gonna have to jump start it. Okay. Yeah. An interior light may have been left on. Okay. Um, I got jumper cables and stuff. Literally, I just drove it less than a week ago. Yeah. Okay. Let me let me pull up a little. The only reason you're selling is because you got a truck. I've got a truck and I've got a little one that's still in a five point harness. Okay. And it's really hard for me to get back there and buckle him in. So Makes I don't sense. really drive it very often. Okay. I mean, I love the car. Trust me. It took me forever to part with myself and say, okay, I'm just going to go ahead and sell it. Right, right. Okay. Considering the mileage, man, it's, it's mint. It's pretty mint. Yeah, it's it runs great. The parts that we replaced, it needed, mm -hmm. um, like the mounts and everything, it was shifting really hard because of all the mounts. Right, right. And so we replaced both the motor and the transmission mounts. The ball joints have been done. Um, when I got it, the windshield wipers actually did not work. Mm -hmm. And we went to like four different junkyards looking for the parts to replace it. Right, right. And these things are just, they're really hard to find yeah. parts for. Yeah. So yeah, you gotta go go all out and get yeah, new we, everything. Yeah. We pretty much went through and took parts off of like three different cars just to get all the parts to fix the windshield wipers. Yeah, it's smooth. I, I love it. It hasn't had like uh, oil or transmission leaks or none of that. Not that I'm aware of. Okay. Um, I've had the oil changed. I don't remember the last time I had it changed because uh -huh. I haven't really been driving it. Right. Right. I usually keep up with changing the oil and stuff. It's got a slight wobble, but I think it's because it's time for the tires to be balanced. Like if you fill it, right. it's just real light. Okay. But I haven't had them balanced in a while, so it's probably more than likely it's what it is. Yeah, overall, I, I think it's a plus. I love this one. Yeah. It's reliable, huh? Yeah, oh yeah. yeah. 
does run good. Oh, yeah. That's why when people, like, tell me that they want to give me <laughs> yeah. 18, 17, I'm like, no. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. Considering no. it being a 03, like, the year the year on Acura's, it's a... Uh, well, and Acura's are built like Honda's. They run forever. Yeah. Like, I had, a, I had an 01 Honda Accord. I don't think that thing died on me until I was over 300,000 miles. Yeah. I was probably closer to 400,000. And uh, all of the headlight bulbs have also been replaced. I mm -hmm. put LED, well, no, they're not LEDs. A couple of them are LEDs. Right, right. Um, the brake lights, all of the rear brake lights and parking lights have been replaced. Okay. And, and this pops open? Yeah, this slides open. And then the buttons over here. Okay. That's, that's as far open as it goes. Oh, that's fine. Long, long, it works. <laughs> right. And its sweet spot for shifting is usually around 2,500 to 3,000 at the most. Okay. You try and shift it any higher than that, and you got to fluctuate with your gas and brake a little bit. Like, if you've got it too high in the RPMs, you've got to let off and let it idle down before you can shift it. Otherwise, it'll be all hard to shift. Gotcha. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah. I don't know how to do that. My fiance does that. And I'm like, yeah. I don't know how you do like that. Like holding the RPMs? Yeah. Does he redline it? And then... <laughs> no. No, he just likes to play with it. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Like he'll do it and he'll drop two gears or he'll upshift two gears and I'm like, babe. <laughs> because if you're on the highway yeah. and you're trying to get past somebody, yeah. but you can't speed up enough, you drop a gear and you can pass them. Yeah. That, I, I do that all the time, honestly. Gotcha. Not all the time, but I do it occasionally. <laughs> somebody's like pacing my bumper and I'm like, all right, I need to get around you. Right, right, right. <laughs> so, I mean, it's got to get up and go. Yeah. Never overheated or nothing? Okay. okay. Never had issues with it overheating. I've everything that has come up wrong with it, we've always fixed. You say y'all replaced the transmission, like the mounts. Oh the mounts, not the trans. No, not the trans, oh, just okay. the mounts. Okay. Um but the clutch has been replaced. Okay. The clutch was replaced about a year ago. Have the alternator went out? Not that I know of. Well, not since you've owned it. Not since I've owned it. Okay. No. And I've had it for. I don't know, I want to say close to two years. Mm -hmm. Maybe a year and a half. This Does this come out or it stays in? Um, like, is it detachable? I don't know if the frame is detachable or not. That might be what this one is. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah, because I wouldn't definitely think they'll try to break in and steal it. Yeah, this we replaced because um, it had another aftermarket stereo in it, but it was missing the knob. So it was just that little bitty dial that was on the inside. Okay. So we replaced it. All right, man. We came to the end of this video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. That was like, I'm going to say a sneak peek. Um, and today I'm actually going over there and uh, we're going to go purchase this car. So y'all stay tuned for the next video, man. Me purchasing the car. And yeah, stay tuned, man. I got a build coming. RSX, it's a base, five-speed manual. And um, I don't know how to drive manual, but uh, I just drove my, <laughs> funny funny thing, last night I drove my father-in-law's uh, little Versa last night, and I just moved it. And like, it seemed like I already, I already know, like I'm gonna teach myself and all that. My journey with learning how to drive stick and all that, Y'all gonna see all that on this channel and you know, just watch my progress with this, learning how to drive stick, building it and shit, making it fast, making it a race car. And that's gonna be my daily and this RSX I'm about to go get right now is uh, that's gonna be my zoom, zoom, zoom. But uh, yeah, y'all stay tuned for next video, man. Thank y'all for tuning in. Subscribe if you new, subscribe if you have been watching man and just be patient with me um i'm gonna get the content out there not fast but it's gonna get out there you uh, know it takes time man i do work i am a father 
And I'm not having excuses, but, you know, it takes time. And editing takes time as well. So thank y'all for tuning in with this video, man. And uh, y'all stay tuned for the next video. It's going to be lit.